Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Dan from DHTV and today I'm going to be showing you how to use 5G on your iPhone 15, 15 Pro, 15 Pro Max or 15 Plus. I'm going to show you how to turn it on, turn it off and configure it if you want to use LTE or other options. Let's get started. All right, so like I said, we've got the iPhone 15 Pro here, and you can do this with any iPhone that supports 5G. Now, what you want to do first to turn on 5G on your iPhone is open up the settings application, and you're going to want to scroll down to where it says cellular. Tap on that. And then from here, you're going to want to tap on cellular data options. This is where you're going to have all of your 5G configuration settings, where you can turn it on, turn it off, and even connect it to LTE. Now the first option we're going to look at is voice and data. You can see I've got it set to 5G auto. If you tap on that, you can set this to 5G on and also LTE. Now I traditionally leave my phone on LTE. I didn't even use 5G with the 14 models, but if you do want to set it up with 5G, just set it to auto. The reason why you would want to set it to auto is that it's going to use 5G only for performance while optimizing the battery life. Keep in mind that 5G does burn through the battery a lot faster than LTE does. If you choose the 5G on option here, it's going to use 5G whenever it's available, even when it's going to reduce the battery life and performance of the phone. So if you're willing to give those things up, then leaving it on 5G on is a great option as well. And you can read these three little paragraphs here. I kind of went through the first two, but it does say 5G may impact battery life and reliability of some voice calls and data. That's why if you are looking to turn off 5G on your iPhone, using LTE is your best option here. Like I said, it works fine for me. And in situations where you do need 5G, you can always come back to this section and then turn it on. Moving back to the page before, we have data mode as well. We're going to tap on that. And there's another setting here. It's allow more data on 5G. It's set to standard by default. But when you allow more data on 5G, your device may then choose to use 5G even over a Wi-Fi connection for software updates, automatic iCloud backups, and higher quality media that you might be watching. So you got to be very careful with this option as if you don't have an unlimited plan, you could quickly burn through the data on your phone. The standard mode here is going to allow for automatic updates and background tasks to run on cellular, but it limits the video and FaceTime quality. Then you have the low data mode here, which is going to help you save data on your phone. So it's going to reduce cellular data usage by pausing automatic updates and background tasks. So choose what you want. I just leave it on standard. And again, you can always come here and make changes if things are causing problems for you. But that is how you set up and turn on 5G on your iPhone 15 models here and how you can turn off 5G and set LTE as your network. Like I said, I prefer LTE these days. It's just more reliable. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. I'm happy to help you out. And if you're looking for more great iPhone tips, tricks, and tutorials, the full iPhone 15 series is in the description. You can click the link and watch more iPhone tips and tricks videos like this one here. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Click the bell notification box so you're notified when I post a new video. That way you can be the first one that comments. First comment always wins. So get to it. Comment on this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.